Allora, we're going to move on to the meatballs. But now, what's, what a lot of people do is they brown the meat, not me. I put it, everything into the pool, raw. I don't believe in frying it again in the oil. It's more fat. More fat. We just take these are hot sauces. Me? Chernobyl. No, me piace, no. Ma Mario piace. He likes it hot. Hot. So I buy hot sausage. I don't need the sausage. I just like the meatballs. And I just put them in here like this. I stand them up sometimes because then they peek out and say hello. See? Well, let me, let me just wash my hands. Make sure you wash your hands and your nails before you put your hands in the meatballs. You get your breadcrumbs and you use the same spices for your meatballs that you just put in your sauce. Simple. There's no thought process here except you got to put breadcrumbs. Cento. I like cento. Whatever's on sale. I don't care. Now, I put these in here. Again, I eyeball it. It depends on how big this is because if your chopped meat is too loose, because I put three eggs. If your chopped meat's too loose, uh, apparently you're gonna have to put a little more breadcrumbs. So I put this much breadcrumbs, whatever that is. To me, it looks like about a cup and a half to two cups. I wet the breadcrumbs. These are plain breadcrumbs, but you can use the other ones, but you still have to add the spices. So I I put a little water in there. I'm going to put three eggs in. But, okay, so here we go. We're back to the seasoning. And again, this is all to the way you like it. It's a little pepper. A garlic powder. These are the softest meatballs you will ever eat in your life. And you never get heartburn from these meatballs. Never. We're going to put the rest of the parsley in here. This off. This, you should use, this is sirloin. Beef sirloin. But you should use the highest, like, the highest number they have, like, that's fat without the fat. It's 85% or 90%. But today I got this. Beef sirloin. Because you're special. And now my hands are all clean. And I'm just going to... I'm just going to get it all together. What again? Alright, so everything... Now, see? You, you have it all together. And now you're just going to start rolling them. And believe it or not, I know people who don't know how to roll a meatball. I'm just going to push these down so they're all in the sauce. Okay. We're going to put the top on. You know? Eat the cheese then. Okay, it's ready. Now. Rub it. We're going to cook this. This thing is going to start going like this. When that happens, which is going to be in about 20 minutes, a half hour, we're going to lower it for 10 minutes, then we shut it, we wait, and then we can boil the macaroni. Actually, we can boil the macaroni after we shut that off. Hmm. Okay, so we're about ready to take this off because the valve dropped. You can't see the valve, but the fact that I'm able to go like this means that it can open. So you take off the nipple or valve and you open it. And when you open the pressure cooker, you can see the oil that's on the top there. Which, you know, is not that much because I used a very high cut of um, of the chopped meat. So I bet it's not smell vision Yeah, it looks beautiful, doesn't it? And that only took about a half an hour to cook and 10 minutes for the, the valve to drop down from start to finish. I mean, we're not talking 6 in the morning here, cutting uh, garlic and 
frying up meat in 16 different pans and pots and whatever else you have to do to fry up this meat. Done. We're ready to eat in about, well, the pasta's almost ready. Probably al dente now. So when your mama call you up for little supper, and the meatball on the table too. Then your mama, she's a call you up for supper. Just to tell you it's a nice Italian stew. Time to eat, time to eat. That's the best time of the day, it's time to eat. Anna, Vito, Carmelo. Oh, oh. It's time to eat some carrots and pizza, throw in a roast, a nice French toast. Oh, Time to eat! That's the meatball song. <laughs> and uh, I like to sing the meatball song every time we eat meatballs. So, so bon appetit! <laughs>